UFOs. Ghosts. Witches. Aliens. They are real. The lore around these cryptids is like, oh, well, if you believe in this, you must be a crazy person. But you sit with these people and, and a lot of them, they feel, you know, quite rational and they're just truthfully telling you their experience. Um, and we thought, God, this is really fascinating. Like, is, is do they believe this because it's true? Do they believe this because there's some sort of trauma? Is somebody weaponizing this against them to try and uh, create some control around them? And all of those things are true to various and sundry degrees, depending on each story. We got cool saying, if you don't stop pursuing this, we'll have you killed. That was when it all exploded. What is the one thing you hope people take away once they're done watching the series? I hope that they learn something uh, deep inside of some of these microcultures um, that they hadn't thought of before. I hope that when they read a headline that seems crazy and they want to judge someone based upon what sounds like crazy behavior, they'll think of the 60 minutes they spent with someone similar and uh, think about it a little bit differently. And I hope there's a little part of everyone's brain, despite the fact that we're irrational and we think that we don't believe these things, that they will be left thinking, I don't know, maybe, because I'll, I'll tell you this, I swim in my little swimming pool in my backyard a lot at night with all the lights out when everyone's asleep. And when I get in that pool, I'm smart, I'm rational, and I know that there is no shark that is going to bite my legs off. But I saw Jaws when I was five years old. <laughs> I'm swimming in that pool, there's just something that's pulling at me and thinking, am I gonna get attacked by a shark here? And that little irrational piece of it, it's, it's childlike and, and interesting and curious. And, and I hope that that remains alive and gets peaked by watching this show. Want more entertainment news? Follow On the Red Carpet on social and subscribe on YouTube.